us to the dead. We have a fix on the exact location. I should think so. That place would track a cost 30,000 tedges. Never mind how much it costs, you steaming krill. Just get a squad of guards out there to bring in that Dr. Rue and his latest piece of totty. The Exalted One will be happy to see him under lock and key. But great matter, their ship has landed in the very center of the Forest of the Dead, alongside the office of Jim. And you know what lives in there? Ah, yes, you are right, Pickle Brain. The monster of the netty will take care of them for us. Let us forget these two and return to our evil work. First up is a lump. Turn that happy ray on the city of Paris. Let the people of Paris be pleasant and polite for the first time in their existence. That really will spoil their day. The very last day, oh great knucker. <laughs> <laughs> All conditions out there okay? A little more nitrogen in the atmosphere than there is on Earth, but it's well within tolerance. Ready to take a look outside, Tara? My very first alien planet. This doesn't look too promising at all, just a flaming forest. Have you locked the TARDIS? That's automatic. When we close that door, nothing in any universe can open it till I use the TARDIS key or this to open it again. And what's that? This is the hypersonic can opener. Use it for a myriad of things, including which way we need to go to find what we came for. And like the TARDIS, it's completely indestructible. Can I have one? Only one of these available for each time machine, whether it's the TARDIS, TARDOS, TARDAT, or any of the other TARD time travel machines used by a Time Lord. But don't worry, I'm not likely to lose it. Let's hope you are male after all. Please don't say how much further. How much further? All right, we'll take a rest. I never said I needed it. Here. So how many of these TARD machines are there? In our universe, um, one for each Time Lord, around 30 at the moment. And I suppose the last two letters in the acronym relate to the Time Lord who owns the TARD. Very good, very good. The TARD stands for Time and Relative Dimensions. Where they are is a matter for each Time Lord. And in your case, the OZ o -Z stands for? Onzeppo. It's one of the moons of Krell, where a lot of the Time Lords of this universe were born and grew up. Ready to move off again? Of course. How far now? Not far. Round about half a mile of the source. <laughs>